Hey there, welcome back to the channel. In today's episode we're diving into a cool upgrade for your BMW motorcycle, installing a tablet on the dashboard. Whether you're looking for GPS navigation, music or just want to enchant your ride, this is the mod for you. Let's get started. Before I was thinking about using a tablet for navigation, I already used my phone to watch the speed and navigate with the DMD2 app. This app has a lot of functionality, which I will cover later in the video. The biggest flaw with using the phone is obviously its screen size. Hence, I found a way to mount a small size Samsung tablet on the dashboard. To do so, I'm using the two screws here to install the mount to the dashboard. The installation of the mount is done in just a few steps. In every step I show you the parts you need and how to install them. First, an SEE cable is needed to supply power from the battery to the front of the bike. The battery is located down here beneath the fuel tank. The wire follows the frame under the tank to the small storage compartment where the USB-C charger is going to be connected. This motorcycle charger comes with an independent power switch and dual USB fast charging ports, which makes it convenient to charge phone and tablet at the same time while riding. This way you can enjoy a long trip without worrying about running out of power. And with the blue LED voltmeter you can monitor the health of your battery in real time. The switch allows you to turn off the power when the bike is not running, preventing the battery is draining. Now that the USB power supply is covered, it's time to get started with the tablet mount. I chose to use the broadhead RAM mount that can be adjusted with these two screws. This way the Samsung tablet I'm going to use will fit perfectly. The construction of the back plate makes it possible to adjust the position of the tablet while riding in the same way you adjust the rear view mirror of a car. Here's a screenshot of the Broadhead mount I used. I think Broadhead have their own shop, but I bought it from another online store. The other part of the mount I bought on AliExpress. This part makes it possible to install the Broadhead on the dashboard. The two parts are connected with four screws and bolts. Now that the mount is installed on the dashboard, I check the function of the windscreen to make sure it can get in the lowest position without touching the tablet. Next, it's time to place the Samsung tablet and make sure it's securely fitted. I use a USB-C to USB-C cable to connect the tablet to the charger. I'm using the Galaxy Tab A9, but in the future I might switch to the Active 3 since it's more robust. But for now I stick to this. As this Galaxy Tab is an Android device, the DMD2 app can be installed. The app is aimed to transform the device into a dashboard for motorcycles. It can be used as an alternative for the instrument panel by connecting your bike's OBD can navigate as a GPS device with option to import GPX routes and has possibilities to show functionalities of other apps like Weather, WhatsApp or Spotify. It even has a roadbook functionality that I still have to figure out myself. In short, the possibilities are endless. That's why I like the versatility of an Android tablet compared to any other device like a GPS. And finally, it's time to test the new setup. If you have any questions about this setup, let me know down below in the comments. I will post a review soon with my experience or when I do another modification. Also, don't forget to like and subscribe and check my other videos. 
Enjoy your rides and stay safe.